Hi, I'm JD. We're going to be looking today is graphs and lines, and we're going to determine points of a line. Let's look at some examples. So we're going to determine whether 1 comma 4, 0 comma 6, 3 comma negative 4 are solutions of the equation 4x plus y equals 8. All right, so let's so what you would do is each of these points has an x coordinate and a y coordinate. And to see if it is a solution or not, you're just going to plug it in. If it's a true statement, it's a solution and therefore it's a point that falls on the line. If it ends up being false when you plug it in, then it's not a solution and therefore it's not on the line. So we're going to start with 1 comma 4. Let's plug that in. So that would be 4 plus 4. 8 equals 8. So that's true. And so yes, 1 comma 4 is a solution. So it is a point that falls on that line. Let's look at the next one. I would just get in the habit of just writing it out. So 0 comma 6. We're going to plug that in. That's 4 times 0, which is 0, plus 6, which is 6. So 6 equals 8. No, that's false. So 0, comma 6 is not a solution. Let's look at that last one. 4x plus y equals 8. And then our point is 3, comma, negative 4. Let's plug that in. 4 times 3 plus a negative 4. That would be 12 minus 4, 8, uh, 12 minus 4, which is 8 equals 8. So yes, 3 comma negative 4 is a solution and therefore it's a point on the line. And with the line itself, there's many points that can fall on the line. And so the equation describes that those points. And when you have a point that falls outside, that's not on the line, it ends up making it false. That's it. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any more questions, please email me at jdmathguy at gmail.com. Thank you, and I hope you have a wonderful day.